We've got some exciting stuff to look at today, my friends, as we're going to be checking out the Tim Wells Signature Series Slotmaster Blowgun from Cold Steel. Stick around. <laughs> Hope you're doing well today my friend i wanted to take a moment to thank all of my subscribers i want to welcome all the new visitors here to 411 outdoors i hope you find this content helpful and resourceful let's get rolling i guess it was a little over a year ago when i picked up the big bore blowgun from cold steel i have had the time of my life shooting that blowgun never actually went out and hunted with it though i could i've just enjoyed incorporating it into a lot of the marksmanship that I do around 411 Outdoors now. As a matter of fact, I had never shot a blowgun up until I got the big bore blowgun from Cold Steel. And I gotta tell you, I'm just very impressed with the capabilities of blowguns in general, especially one that powerful. But since then, I've been hearing so many great things about the Tim Wells edition. And I'm sure most of you who follows this channel knows completely well who Tim Wells is. He's a world-class world-renowned, world-famous hunter with a massive YouTube channel, I think over a million subscribers. And the first time I ever got familiar with Tim Wells was I went out and searched for a video that I had heard about where he actually took down a black bear with a blowgun. And that was my introduction to the world of how incredibly effective these things can be. One of my objectives in this video is to be able to give you several reasons why you should consider getting this edition of the blowgun, even if you have the big bore blowgun, because you're probably asking the same question I was is, you know, what's the difference? What does this blowgun have that the big bore does not? Before we go any further, I want to show you the packaging. I purposefully left this in its package before opening it up because I want you to see what it looks like if you ever decide to go out and get this. It's packaged up very well. I was very happy to see that big Amazon box on my front porch when I got home, because that is where I've got mine. So let's look at some of the specifications here. So starting at the top here, it says, see what this baby can do. Scan and watch the video now. So you can click on this little scanned object here to kind of get a clip of what this is capable of. Looking at some of the specs here, we've got 20 razor tip broadhead darts. Now you do not get any broadhead darts with the big bore blowgun. You do get 10 mini broadhead darts professional mouthpiece, quiver guard, and a quiver. Mr. Wells said, I've never shot a faster, more hard-hitting, accurate blowgun in all my life. I love this baby, and you will too. The Slockmaster blowgun by Cold Steel can fire up to 200 feet per second. Fastest, most powerful blowgun in the world. This also shows you some of the darts that are available elsewhere. Now, if you get the big bore blowgun, you get your smaller darts you get your bamboo darts and some of these stun darts <laughs> they're a lot of fun you can see what i did with that in my initial big bore blowgun review what i'm gonna do now is get this cut out of the package and put together because we're going to be rocking and rolling with this pretty soon when you take this out of the package it comes in two pieces just like this that you can put together now you can put it together and use the full length or you can just use this short piece depending upon what you're trying to do still smacks pretty good even when it's in its short form. The first upgrade that I wanna talk about concerning this blowgun outside of just the appearance as a whole is the more ergonomic mouthpiece. This has a more ergonomic mouthpiece than the big bore blowgun. The second feature would be its olive green color, making it more easy to camouflage. This blowgun is also significantly greater in length when it's put together, allowing you to get the maximum power. I wanted to give you a side-by-side -side comparison, just showing you the difference between the length. You can see the difference in quality here just in general. It also has a more comfortable hand guard. And as I mentioned earlier, you get the broadhead darts with this blowgun. With the big bore blowgun, you do not get the broadhead darts. Something I pointed out as well in my big bore blowgun review is that they come with these caps. You know, you can use these as a walking stick. You can cap it up and you know, if you're walking through the woods, you can use this as a walking stick as well. I think that's just about enough talk about the blowgun. Let's get out and have some fun with it. All right, I've got a broadhead dart here. I've got it fully connected. I'm gonna send it packing all the way down there to the target. For future reference, these broadhead darts are volatile. They bend easy, so if you're hitting hard targets, they're gonna get bent and all that kind of stuff. These things are meant to penetrate something soft. Nice hit, let's take a look. Nice little smack here, as you can see, went through all the way. 
Again, if there's ever any question of what this can do, it took out a black bear. Now, granted, a very skilled hunter was using it, but it took out a black bear. When loading the dart, make sure that you push it past that first notch or you're gonna blow your ears out. I'm exaggerating a little bit, but honestly, it feels like it. There's times I didn't have it in all the way and I blew it, it was like, <clears throat> and it just like filled my ears up, man. It was painful. So make sure you push it past that notch. We're about 12 meters out right here. Take a little bit more of a distance shot. It had a bit of a descent in flight, but it still hit with good power. Let's try it again. Gotta make sure you get a good breath. <laughs> Thanks, got some power. I've been shooting into a rather hard target. I wanna show you how this hits something a little softer, such as this pine grain. The broadhead is pretty much buried into this, so I'm gonna have to dig this out. As far as aiming and accuracy is concerned, like so many things, I think this tool is primarily instinctive. You know, you, you look down the end of this very long barrel and you just feel it, you just feel your shot. I'm gonna try to hit something kind of small to kind of validate what I'm saying. I'm gonna go for this X right here. I'm roughly 25 to 30 feet from my target here. I landed about six inches below the target because my arrow lost some flight. I'm going to try this again. I took a second shot. This time I was about four inches too low. So I'm gonna make some adjustments here. These heavy darts, they hit hard, but they do lose flight pretty quickly. All right, that was a lot better. So I was a little high, so I, I'm in the vicinity. It's just, it's a matter of just getting familiar with, you know, levels depending upon your distance. I'm a lot more accurate with my big bore blow gun, but that's just because I'm used to it. This one's just gonna take some getting used to. One thing's for sure, I can clearly feel the difference in power with this one. Cold Steel Tim Wells Signature Series Slot Master, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you enjoyed this review. I hope you found it helpful. The only dilemma that I'm facing now is when am I gonna get out and hunt with this thing because this is too serious of a blowgun to have to just be patty caking and bebopping around in the backfield, if you know what I mean. Thank you so much for watching. I'll be dropping a link in the description. You can find this anywhere, Cold Steel, Amazon. It's about 50 some bucks, but man, what a package you get for 50 some dollars. Well, please drop your comments in the comments section if there's something that I didn't cover. Uh, I'd love to try my best to answer the questions for you. As always, thanks for watching. Take care.